Deuteronomy chapter 18 The Lord your God will raise up for you a prophet like me from among you, from your countrymen brothers. You shall listen to him. This is according to all that you asked of the Lord your God in Horeb on the day of the assembly, saying, Let me not hear again the voice of the Lord my God. Let me not see this great fire any more, or I will die. The Lord said to me, They have spoken well. I will raise up a prophet from among their countrymen brothers like you, and I will put my words in his mouth, and he shall speak to them all that I command him. It shall come about that whoever will not listen to my words which he shall speak in my name, I myself will require it of him. But the prophet who speaks a word presumptuously in my name, which I have not commanded him to speak, or which he speaks in the name of other gods, that prophet shall die. You may say in your heart, how will we know the word which the Lord has not spoken? When a prophet speaks in the name of the Lord, if the thing does not come about or come true, that is the thing which the Lord has not spoken. The prophet has spoken it presumptuously. You shall not be afraid of him. Ezra chapter 9 But now for a brief moment, grace has come from Yahweh our God to preserve a remnant for us and give us a stake in his holy place. Even in our slavery, God has given us new life and light to our eyes. Though we are slaves, our God has not abandoned us in our slavery. He has extended grace to us in the presence of the Persian kings, giving us new life. So that we can rebuild the house of our God and repair its ruins to give us a wall in Judah and Jerusalem. Psalms He spread a cloud as a covering and gave a fire to light up 
the night. Oh, send out your light and your truth. Let them lead me. Let them bring me to your holy mountain and to your dwelling places. Then I will come to the altar of God, to God my greatest joy. I will praise you with the lyre, O God, my God. Isaiah chapter 7 Therefore the Lord himself will give you a sign. Behold, a virgin will be with child and bear a son, and she will call his name Emmanuel. God is with us.